No, nope, just 12.2. 12.2 feet. I want to point out, because I saw it on the quiz, some people made the mistake. I know what you did. I just want to fix it. Some of you, when you got to this, this final answer stage and you're trying to tell me that R is 12.2 feet is your final answer, some of you gave me this is your answer. That's not correct. It's not the square root of 12.2 feet anymore. The answer is just 12.2 feet. I knew what you did. I knew you had the right answer. You're just adding stuff you don't need to add. At this point, the answer is 12.2 feet. There is no more square root. We took the square root. So the square root at this point is gone. Same thing for the r. It's just r. It's not the square root of r anymore. It's just plain old r. All right, don't get square root sign. All right, example five. Read it carefully. Circle has an area of 153.86 centimeters squared. How long is its diameter? Circle has an area of 153.86 centimeters squared. How long is its diameter? Okay, so same formula, A equals pi r squared. A is going to be this 153.86 number. pi is 3.14, r squared says r squared. All right. How do I solve the equation? Okay. Just like I did in the last one, right? You're going to divide by 3.14. Now, if you divide by 3.14 in this one, you get that r squared equals 49. Okay, now what do I do? Take the square root. So I take the square root all the way across. Square root all the way across, and I get r equals 7. Okay, but the question doesn't say how long is the radius. The question says how long is the diameter. So what do I have to do now to go from radius to diameter? To multiply by 2, I have to double it. So I double this number and I find out that the diameter is 14, as in 14 centimeters long. Again, radius is half, diameter is whole length. Alright, one more. Example 6. The most difficult problem of all tonight. Find the area of the white space. Maybe it just said the green space, but I don't want to say the white space. Find the area of the white space if each circle has a radius of 6 centimeters. Find the area of the white space if each circle has a radius of 6 centimeters. So they want to know what, like these corners and the shape in the middle and the cardinal rows north, south, east, west direction, what those little spots make. Circles, no. They're talking about those corners more. Find the area of the white space. If each circle has a radius of six centimeters. Okay, now circles, circles are no problem for us. We can find the area of the circles without much difficulty. Again, formula for rate, uh, area of a circle is pi r squared. So that's 3.14 times 6 squared, or 3.14 times 36. 3.14 times 36 is 113.04. Now, of course, that's just the area of one circle, obviously. There are four circles here, so I'm going to have to multiply that by four to find all four circles <coughs> together. And when I multiply that by four, that's going to give me 452.16. OK. 
Okay, so I know the area of the circles. Now I have to come up with the area of the whole shape. The area of it is actually a square. I'll find the area of the square. Remember, square is length by width. Anybody got an idea of how I'm going to find the side length of the square? The same as what? Okay, let's take a look. Remember, the only piece of information we're given is that the radius measures six centimeters. So that's the distance from the edge of the circle to the middle. So that piece is six centimeters. Now, of course, I could turn my radius and bring it this way, and that piece too would also make six centimeters. Now, if I go to my other circle and do the same thing, from the center to the edge, six centimeters. And from the center to the edge, six centimeters going the other way. As you can see, now I know how long the side of the square is. There's just four radii that make up that whole length. They're each six, that means the side is 24 long. And this must be two. Now I've got the length of the square. So now i got what I need. So for the square, we're going to do 24 times 24, which is 576. Okay, so what do I have to do now to finish the problem? What do I have to do to finish the problem? I got the square, I got the circles, I don't want those, I want these other little pieces. How am I going to do that? What do you think, Nick? Subtract 452.16 from 576. Good. I'm going to subtract this from 576. Once I subtract it off, then I've got what's left, which is what I want. And when I subtract it off, I get 123.84. And that would be <coughs> centimeters squared. 